Okay. And we're back again. So I'm gonna make some curry chicken. People been asking me. When you do wanna do some meat, how come you can't see you doing any meat? Why? Because you're vegetarian or pescatarian, you don't want to do meat. So I'm gonna do some curry chicken. My special curry chicken. I'm putting one shot glass of oil. That's all I'm using. Into the bad boy. This here is called the bad boy. It's an electric um, pot. I have here I have here chicken seasoning, all purpose seasoning, mixed spice, curry, turmeric powder, and some sea salt. Alright? So that's what we're gonna be using. But while that is warming up, I'm gonna cut some onion and garlic. So I'll put that up to about 90 degree, 100 degree for now. I like this, I like cooking in this one because I can control the fire. Put a hundred, a hundred degrees on the fire while I chop my onion and crush the garlic. Yes, yeah, so I got one medium sized onion, one medium sized onion, and three cloves of garlic. So, chopped, already chopped. I put the onion in there first, get that in there. Give that two minutes or so. Onion in there. I want to dry off this spoon because you don't want to put wet spoon into a pot with oil. That can be dangerous. So you make sure your spoon dry or your fork or whatever you have dry. You get some paper towel or something and dry it off properly. We're gonna saute them onions. I'll put it up to a 120. 120. I need the fire a little bit hotter than that. Put the garlic in as well. Why not? Onion and the garlic in. I forget to tell you about the time so I got some time here. Right, we need that in there. I can't cook without my time. So I'm sauteing that. Let that saute. I like this bad boy still. I don't think I've done a video with it before. And I would suggest when you you get yourself a whole chicken, but don't just buy any chicken. It's anybody can go to the shop and buy any chicken. But you don't you don't want to buy just any chicken. Go to the shop or go to the farmer's market or wherever you can and get yourself a free weight chicken. Try not to all try not to buy the corn fed. Neither because corn some of the corn is um GMO. I know what I'm saying. So you get yourself a good free-range chicken, medium size. 
you cut it up into small pieces and that's in in my opinion that's the best chicken to use free range not the one they're selling in all these butcher shops and not the corn fed one because if you notice you will see the corn fed chicken kind slightly yellow try to use the free range chicken and when you buy the free range chicken if you notice when you buy the free range when you buy the other chicken you don't get the uh, the, um, the, the, the giblets like the heart the liver and others when you buy the free range chicken they give you all this thing here so you got the neck in there the heart and the liver I'm gonna put that in later because it's, it's softer than the chicken so I'll put that in when the chicken is a half cook I'm gonna wash it and put it on put it in when chicken is a half cook I'm gonna wash my thyme everything remember wash your hands and anything you put it in the pot also wash hygiene is very important them onions is sauteing nicely They're coming on you could use any onion red or white doesn't matter if you don't have onion you could even use spring onion don't matter just get some type of onion some type of garlic and saute it or burn it or better and while that is burning don't put the salt yet leave the salt for last so what I'll, I'll put the salt in another container leave the salt for last don't put the salt yet so all this other season you could put them in but don't put the salt leave the salt for last because these season have salt and that's about a tablespoon of each so you put that in there you want to burn the curry or the turmeric powder you get this all slightly slightly burned not over burned I put the stove I put the burner up as well I doubled the, the heat because I find it wasn't hot enough so now I'm at a hundred and 80 degrees this is fiery hot so look at that that's looking so nice I want to add the chicken them in here slowly no fasting slow cooking this is not fast food slow food that's how you want the food to cook fire low slow cook so I'll put them in one by one so if you notice the chicken have some fats on it that fat is enough oil so the one shot glass I put in is more than enough water more than enough oil I mean sorry What I have here is one whole chicken I cut into small pieces. You can use whatever part of the chicken if you want to use um, do some chicken wing this way or any part of the chicken. You can cook it however you like. Whatever part of the chicken you, you, you have. So you don't necessarily have to get a, a, a whole chicken. But this is what I like to do most of the time i'm just telling you what i like to do or what i like you can also do what you like or use the part and thing that you like it's just what i like that way i see what i am getting i know what i got So 
how that look make that don't cover it yet let that kind of fry for some five to six minutes don't cover it then you're gonna put here some water uh, hot water or boiling water I'm gonna prepare some water I'm gonna put it in there and then make it simmer so before you do that before you do that make sure that it's slightly fried yeah looking good gonna come back when we're putting in the come back when I'm putting in the water all right so I'm gonna turn them be careful not to burn yourself don't mind that bottom that's slightly burned that's one of your greatest assets for later when it's simmering down. Cause that's create that create a lot of goodness down at the bottom there for you. Mm. So the curry rich. It's a rich curry. And the turmeric powder together is a great combination and the mixed spice of all that give it a great nice smell it's looking good so what i'll do now is add two cups of water and this is the only time I will cover it this is the time I will cover it and let it simmer now you can add your pepper if you want you can add your thyme if you want but still don't add your salt yet as I said I, I like when you taste first before you put the salt don't have to you can just throw it in there if you like but I like to taste first before putting in the salt so you can go ahead and put the salt in if you want to but um, it's better to taste first so that you don't over salt it because some of these seasons they have salt then you add salt and let the salt is too much so I'll let that cook for half an hour and then come back I like this bad boy looking so nice yeah okay and i'm back so after half an hour this is where i'm at so this is when i put in the chili there's no curry without chili if you curry in then you need to use chili or scotch bonnet pepper throw all of that in that's three small chili or one whole scotch bonnet if you're using a scotch bonnet do not put the seed then you put in the neck I got two neck they gave me extra giblets two heart 
and two liver. All right, so you're gonna spin that in, and then you're gonna leave it for another half an hour and come back again. put this in halfway because these are easier to cook if you put them in when you just start they're just gonna overcook mash up and disappear right. so we cover that and come back again after half an hour Wanted to show you how the bad boy operate. See that? It operate like a pressure cooker is steaming away. I really like this bad boy. And you can control the the, the, um, the temperature. So over there it's got a temperature gauge that I use to control the temperature. It, it's electric. Actually it's very very nice. But very overpriced. Okay, let's see. Mm-hmm. Now oh, that's looking nice. Exactly half an hour later. It's looking nice. I think it's ready. An hour should be enough time. I think it's ready. Yeah man, it's ready. Let me get this time out. All the times come off. Just leave the stick. Please be careful not to burn yourself. Don't you don't have to do it the way I do it. I could use something to take out the, the time stick. bubbling nicely look at that that's looking good I'll come back again when I'm sharing out. Just to give you one last.
that smells so nice that look nice it even sound nice Cut that. Well, thank you very much for watching that's curry chicken with some rice and peas put some salad on the side maybe a slice of avocado that's you that good to go all right thank you very much for watching and have a great day